Hey, what's up guys? Eli Fishman here with Talking Ball Interviews on YouTube. Today I'm with Cameron Cannon, Boston Red Sox prospect. Cameron, thanks so much for coming on today. Yeah, thank you for having me. Starting off your career with a second round draft pick this year to the Boston Red Sox. You know, what's your draft story and talking about that feeling when you got your name called? Yeah, I, I was uh, I was sitting because you know I wasn't sure if I was gonna go first day, so I just kind of you know sat there and watched the draft and and watch watch my buddies get picked and and stuff like that. And I was sitting there with with my parents and just hoping my name would be called. And and fortunately, it it, it was by the by the best team in the in the big league. So um, the Red Sox reigning champions, and you were their first pick. They didn't have a first round pick. How cool is that to be part of such a historic organization? reigning world champions and to be their first pick in the major league baseball draft yeah i couldn't ask for anything more i've i've before the draft i've heard nothing but but great things about the red sox organization and and um i'm very lucky that that they decided to choose me how's the pro baseball grind been and how are you enjoying the professional baseball life it's awesome I, i'm having a lot of fun every single day uh especially with these guys i, I got lucky with 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 the team I'm 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 on right now for my first year of pro ball, you know I love every single one of the dudes, the coaching staff. It's it's been a lot of fun. Now the bus rides here are a little bit crazy in the New York Penley. You guys have some some pretty far trips. How's the how's that grind been? And then when when you were at the rookie camp, you guys had to wake up extremely early. You know how's that been? Yeah, it's uh it, it's been a little uh it's been a grind, but you know I I I came into it expecting it so. So I'm just doing the best I can to have fun with it and, and kind of embrace that challenge. On the field, how's the comp competition difference been from Pac-12 baseball? Uh, it's been really good. Uh, a little little different style of, uh, of play, uh, I'd say, rather than uh, college or in the Pac-12. But, but, you know, I'm doing the best I can to make adjustments and, and to learn every single day. So I think it's going great. What's been your favorite part of pro baseball? Playing every single day. Talking about your on-the-field self, you know, what are some of your best tools, and what could people expect out of you? Um, I'd say, I'd say, <laughs> I'd say, uh, you know, one of my best tools is is probably my my hit tool, and and you know, I do best I can every single day to to uh, apply that to help my team win every day. Are you superstitious at all? Uh, I wouldn't. No, I wouldn't say I am. Um, I'll try to do little things the same. You know, when I walk up to the plate, have a have a routine, but I wouldn't say I'm superstitious. What's your approach to the plate and approach, you know, stepping out of the batter's box? Are you thinking about anything in specific, looking at anything? Yeah, I'd say my approach changes uh, depending on the situation um, that, that I walk up to, you know, guy on third base, less than two outs, you know, just put contact on the ball, get the guy in. Um, maybe, maybe it'll change uh, with, with the style of pitcher up there. So. All right, man, thank you so much for joining me today. Much, much appreciated. Very nice to meet you. Thank you so much.